Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, an agriculture teacher. We are in Form uh, 3, Lesson 5, and the topic is Livestock uh, Production 3. And the subtopic is, uh, it, it, it deals with um, the meeting in livestock. On to the lesson objective. By the end of this lesson, you should be able to, number one, explain the meaning of the term meeting. And number two, explain various signs of heat uh, in livestock. Then we go to the meeting. Uh, meeting by definition is the process of serving a cow with a bull for the purpose of reproduction. That is what we refer to as mating. Then we have oestra cycle. What is oestra cycle? This refer to the duration from one heat period to the other. Remember, after mating, the fertilization might not be successful, meaning that uh, after a given duration of time, the heat uh, signs uh, will also be uh, noticed. Then we have the general signs of heat in livestock. Uh, what are we supposed to look so that we can know a given animal is on heat? The first one we have restlessness. The animal is restless at all time. Then number two, mounting on others or climbing on others. You find that uh, the female normally mount on others uh, when it comes uh, when it is on heat. Then the second one, there is slight uh, rise in body temperature, uh, uh, slightly uh, rise in body temperature. Then number four, slight drop in milk yield in lactating animals. Those animals which are being milk, you find that there is a slight drop of milk uh, production levels. Then we have a uh, clear and slimy uh, mucus from the vagina. You normally see uh, slimy and mucus like uh, fluid coming from the vagina. Then the sixth one we have mowing and uh, bleating frequently. Uh, for example, mowing uh, for a cow, uh, mowing in a cow, then we have bleating in a goat. Uh, you can see the images of uh, goats and uh, sheep uh, bleating. Then we have uh, the seventh uh, frequent urination and this is commonly found in uh, uh, pig and also in rabbit. Uh, they normally pass a lot of urine when they are on heat. Then the eighth is swelling and reddening of vulva. That is uh, the, 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 the exter external part of the female reproductive uh, system uh, normally swell. Then we have the doe rubbing herself against the wall and also the doe are uh, peeping through the cages uh, so that it can communicate uh, with the other rabbits in the next or adjacent uh, cage. Then we have uh, oestrus period for different animals uh, which are uh, laid in the farm. The first one we have for a cow, we have an oestrus period of 21 days. Then we have for a sow, that is 21 days also. Then we have a doe, the female uh, rabbit, that is 14 days. Then for a ewe, uh, it takes a duration of 17 days to repeat again. And Finally, we have the nanny, that is the she goat. It normally takes 21 days for the cycle to repeat again. If the first, uh, uh, if after serving the animal, the, the, the fertilization did not take place and therefore the oestrus period must repeat uh, itself once again. We have come to the end of today's lesson and I'm going to mark uh, the end of this lesson by assigning you uh, some questions. The first question is define the term mating and number two, highlight any five signs of heat in cattle. Then uh, for reference, you can refer from Secondary Agriculture Student Book 3 and the publisher is the Kenya Literature Bureau. For more information or if you would like to clarify something from us, you can reach us through the following uh, contacts. You can use the SMS using the number which is well displayed for you. You can also use YouTube at Elim TV, then a Facebook platform at Elim TV and also you can tweet us at Elim TV 
underscore ke. Thank you for joining me in this lesson. Till next lesson, goodbye.